Yeah, wonderful people, viewers and subscribers. Chapali Chapali, I want to bring to you with what is happening around the NBA. Remember just recently, um, this hero of our time. I love this woman. These women that are so outspoken, they are a rare gem. To expose the president of NBA at their annual conference. Make a listen. Statements and the treasurer's reports as obtainable in um, the bondo was put together by somebody else. was arrived at without my singular involvement yeah, in is free and fair. I would say that um, the elections went well. Those who came out uh, were happy to express their franchise. There were challenges, definitely. There were challenges that we, we got. Uh, some infractions of, uh, of, of the rule. Some of them actually constituted electoral offenses. Uh, but, but on the whole, on the whole, uh, I would score INEC as having uh, performed maybe about 78-80% and uh, uh, in, in the delivery of these elections and that, that would be an A for, for every exam uh, notwithstanding all the things that happened which we are not ignoring and, and that is uh, why we are we are admonishing INEC, we are advising INEC, and we are recommending to INEC that in those areas where we saw lapses in the elections held on the 25th of 
after February 2023. Deliberate efforts must be taken to make sure that those lapses did not occur again. No wonder it is birds of the same feather who was planted by this APC government sponsored by the Jagabans in order to use MBA to justify the criminality that happened at the election, the presidential election. Yes. Yes. That is just it. And that is why Nigerians have lost hope in the judiciary, in Africa, in Nigeria, particularly for this presidential election. That's why their eyes are on the judiciary. Can you imagine? These are the people that the people say, oh, the last hope of the common man is on the judiciary. See how corrupt they are. We actually thanked Mr. President for the choice of Prince Latifa Bumi as the President of the, uh, as the uh, Attorney General uh, of the Federation. It wasn't a mistake. We are proud of that choice. And we've also told Mr. President that we would support the Honorable Attorney General. That is why I say that every time I speak, I tell you that corruption is an institution in Nigeria. There is no two ways about it. Please help us share this and celebrate this woman. La Didi, um, Caroline, she is a wonderful woman. Thank you for bringing this to the notice of Nigerians, and we'll all keep our eyes on the judiciary. The NBA members, it's up to you to redeem yourselves. I know there are wonderful people among you. Rise up within yourself, purge yourselves from all manner of criminal elements and corrupt individuals who always hijack trade and professional unions like this in order to keep the people down. It's up to you. Nigerians, this revolution should spread across your school, your working place, your market, your town union, even your church. Make sure that every element of these corrupt people should be purged out of your system if we must have a breath of a fresh air. If the poor must breathe in Nigeria, <laughs> I'm signing out. What's your opinion on this? Drop it on the comment section and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Bye-bye for now.